nice shoes shouldn't go on those ugly feet. Ah! They're my shoes! I can wear them if I want! Give them back right now! I need them for my dance! Hey girls and guys, I decided from Style Let's Play and we are back at Royal High School and I am back with my friend Amanda. So you might be wondering why I'm wearing this new outfit. Well, while Amanda and I were gone for a few months, I actually got really into ballet and today is going to be my first ballet recital ever. I am going to perform in front of like a hundred people and I am so nervous. So Amanda helped me out by letting me borrow her shoes and her crown and stuff. But I want to show her my outfit before I get ready for the night because I want to see what she thinks. You know, Amanda's got good style. So we've got to, got to get her opinion on things, see if she likes it and all that. Amanda, ugh, always on the computer, that girl. Amanda, Hurry, I need your opinion. I have to get ready for recital in a couple hours. So what do you think about my outfit? By the way, thank you so much for letting me borrow your shoes. They are perfect. And the crown, which you got from winning prom queen. Yes. That's okay. So what do you think? Do you like the dress? Like, what do I look like? Your outfit's nice, I guess. Shoes are nice. But you, you, you guess. Just nice. I need to look gorgeous. But that bow? What's wrong with my bow? I thought it added character. Ew. Ugh. So you think I should remove the bow? I mean, I kind of thought it added a little personality to the outfit, you know, a little pizzazz. Ew, 100%. Ugh. Fine, I'll take it off and you can tell me what you think it looks like after. All right, how's that? Is that better? I've got a little tiny bow at the back instead. Much better. So. Do I look good? You've got to tell me better than I look nice, okay? Nice is so basic. I want to look fabulous, okay? You look six out of 10. Ah! Okay, maybe I'll look better once I get my makeup done and stuff, right? I need to try to at least to get to like a nine. Look, if Amanda gives me a nine, that means I'm like really like a 20 out of 10 because she is harsh. <laughs> yeah, your face is a bit plain. Ah! Okay, well anyway, are you going to be at my recital? I mean, it's going to be my first day there. I'm going to be twirling and everything. Like, look, I'm just going to show you some of my moves, okay? Look at that. Good, isn't it? <laughs> Definitely not going to be doing this dance. but not, Or that one. Nope, not that one. Maybe a little of this. You know? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm definitely gonna mess up, aren't I? <gasps> I need to be there to make sure you don't ruin my shoes. Uh, no, you need to be there to support me. I want you to bring me flowers. I want you to throw them when I'm done performing. And if nobody claps, you better clap really loud, okay? Like, I, cause, oh my gosh, it's gonna be so embarrassing. Imagine, like, nobody even claps for me or something. Ugh. Anyway. I have to go get ready. I've got to go get my, you know, redo my hair because I got to have a shower because I don't want to smell bad. I'll be there. Thank you. I love you. Thank you for the crown and the shoes again. I don't know what I would do without you. I'm going to be wearing the earrings you got me from Paris as well. So don't worry. Once the look is complete, I guarantee you're going to give me a 10 out of 10. All right. So I'm going to go get ready. I love you and I'll see you around. Oh my gosh. I just told her I love her. Oh. She used to be my bully and now I'm telling her I love her. Wow. All right. So now that I am done and I've showed her my outfit and she approves, I'm going to take all of this off. Actually, I need to go take off the crown and stuff in my room so I don't lose them in the shower. I'm going to take off my crown, leave my shoes here. I already have my earrings and then I'm going to go have a shower. So let's take these things off. Woo! I look rough. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna run over to the bathrooms in my bathing suit. I just don't want the dress to get dirty or wrinkled or anything. I cannot afford that for that dress to get ruined or the shoes or the crown. Because if I lose that crown, Amanda is going to kill me. I can't believe she actually let me borrow it either. Uh, hopefully the spa isn't too busy. It shouldn't be because everyone's probably like just in their dorms relaxing and stuff. All right, so I'm gonna have a quick shower. Then I've got to blow dry my hair, get my makeup on, put on some perfume. <gasps> I am so excited. I've been working really hard for my first recital and I hope all of the hard work paid off. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and shampoo my hair and stuff. And then I should be out the shower any second now. <sighs> Feeling better already. I feel like I'm just nervous, but it's okay to be nervous. I mean, it's my first performance ever. Let's play, spray some rose. Maybe I should, you know what? I'm gonna go with everything. 
it doesn't hurt to smell really super good. So I'm just going to put on everything right now. <laughs> okay, let me get rid of my head towel because I feel like my hair is finally dry. <sighs> Let's brush this because I hate my hair when it's super, super tangly. There we go. Get all the tangles out. Perfect. And then I'm going to give it one final little blow dry. Just make sure it's super, super dry because I don't want my hair falling flat during the performance. I think I'm going to stick to the bun anyway. I feel like that was a good choice. So, okay, let me go back over here and let me do my hair. Hair is done. Check. And it came out just as good as before. So perfect. It's going to fit my crown and everything. Now it is time for some makeup because apparently Amanda told me I look too plain and too basic. So I'm going to just put on a little bit of makeup, something natural. Oh, there we go. See, it's nothing too crazy. Just put on some contacts, put on a little bit of lip gloss. All right, makeup, hair is done. I'm gonna head over to my dorm room right now. Uh, let me get rid of this towel as well while I'm at it. All right, towel is done, hair is on point, makeup is on fleek, good. Okay, let's just hurry up and get up there. All righty, okay, so, oh, there's my room right there. Oh, I almost face planted. Oh my gosh, I can't ruin my makeup or my hair. <gasps> oh, my golly, Jeebus. Okay, let's go back into my dorm. All right, here we are. All right, let's see. I got to get my dress on. I'm not going to go with the bow because I do kind of agree with Amanda's point. You know, it is kind of not that cute and stuff. All right, where did I leave everything? Okay, here we go. Let's get my dress on. All right, so dress is on. Oh, I got to take off the, the bow though. Definitely. She said she didn't like it. I, I agree with her idea. So I have my earrings on that Amanda gave me from Paris. Oh, yes. I've got my crown. Now, the only thing is I can't remember where I left those shoes. I mean, I'm 100% sure I had left them in here, but I can't seem to find my shoes anywhere. And without my shoes, I can't perform. Oh, where are they? Wait, is that Beth outside my dorm? Uh, Beth? Looking for something? Yes, I am. But why are you even in my dorm? I don't, like, why are you here right now? I do not need this stress right now. I'm about to do the biggest performance of my life, and I have Beth, the new bully here. So, ugh. Beth, can you just leave, please? Because I can do what I want. Well, no, you can't. You're not allowed to come into my dorm. I'm pretty sure if I tell the principal that you came into my dorm, you're going to get in trouble. So just get out, please. I'm just looking for something and I don't need this right now, okay? As you can tell, I'm getting ready for something and I do not need the added stress. So can you just go? What are you looking for? Uh, excuse me, what are you doing? You're not just allowed to walk in my room. Oh, I'm looking for my shoes, okay? That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for my shoes. For my ballet shoes. So, unless you know where they are, please just leave. I'm helping you look. Oh, really? You're helping me look? How about you just leave? That's the way you could help me. Beth, what are you doing? I literally have like 10 minutes to get ready. Can you just leave? Oh, this is stressing me out. I need to find these shoes. Maybe I left them in Amanda's room. What happens if you can't find them? If I can't find my shoes, I can't perform. I need them, please. It's a rule. You have to have ballet shoes in order to perform the ballet dance. Oh, what a shame. Beth, no, 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 Beth, get back here. Beth, what did you do? Beth, did you steal my shoes? I need them. If I don't have my shoes, I'm not gonna be able to perform today. You stole them, didn't you? Oh, you're such a snake. Just give them back, please. I don't care if we have a history or whatever. Look, when you first came to this school, you were getting bullied and I helped you out. I gave you a makeover. I made everyone fall in love with you. Just think about that. Nice shoes shouldn't go on those ugly feet. Ah, oh, they're my shoes. I can wear them if I want. Give them back right now. I need them for my dance. Please. No. Are you kidding me? You can't just steal stuff from people. Beth. I'm begging you, please give me back my shoes. I need them. I've been working so hard for this for a few months now. I'm gonna ruin your dance. No, 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 Beth, please. I, I'll do whatever you want. Is there anything, I'll do your homework for a week. I'll, whatever, just please give me my, is there anything I could do? Anything at all? Please? 
You want money? I'll give you money. Beg. I'm begging you already. Please, Beth, please give me back those shoes. Amanda's gonna kill me. Not only did I lose her shoes, I'm not gonna get to perform. Amanda's gonna be mad at me. Not good enough. Oh no, please, Beth. I need them. I'm begging you. I'm gonna throw them in the fire. No! Beth, stop! Did you just... Are you kidding me? Did you really just do that? Beth. Those were my shoes. They didn't even belong to me. They belonged to Amanda, your sister. They look hot now. Beth, please get out. Just please just go. I know violence is not the answer, so I'm trying not to hurt her right now. So I just need her to get out of my face. I don't want to be in here anyway. What am I going to do? Without my shoes, I can't perform. Now I have to tell Amanda? Amanda is going to kill me. I'm just going to have to find something else to wear. And I'm going to have to break the news to Amanda after. I'll see what I have in my closet. All I have is these. You know what? It's not even worth going to this ballet recital anymore. It's dumb. I'm not going to be able to perform like this. The teacher's probably not even going to let me get on stage. It was a dumb idea anyway. Now I just hate the fact that I'm going to have to tell Amanda that her sister threw the shoes in the fire. Ugh. What's the point of even trying anymore? I'm just going to call the teacher and tell him I'm sick and I can't be there. And I'm just going to spend the rest of the day hiding in the spa, hiding from Amanda so I don't have to tell her the truth. Why does Beth have to be such a bully? I mean, when we first met her, she was so sweet and so kind. It's like, what happened to her? Oh, this is just going to cause more drama between Beth and Amanda. I already know it. But anyway, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.